So with this uh, being such a historic moment for meme creators and digital artists with yourself, what's going through your mind now that the sales ended and you've had time to kind of like process everything? It's still it's still an active thing for me. Like I know the NFT sold just a few days ago, but like I just brought new life into all my work. And now I'm like, just, I haven't really slept, but like it's a good thing because I've been working hard and I'm like so ready to, new, to do new things. It's like opened up a whole new door for me. I'm really excited. Yeah, I definitely think uh, it's funny how you kept saying, you know, like, I hope this opens up the floodgates. I think I think it worked. Like, I know I kept saying that, but I honestly I honestly think that um, it definitely has worked. This is all for the artists out there. Like, do your art, make, make some money, make yourself known. And that's kind of always been my thing from the start, like making sure everybody gets proper attribution to their work. Given your struggles to be recognized or properly paid for creating Yen Cat uh, in the past, does it feel validating for us to finally come about nearly a decade later? I think so. Um, I think it's more about, I'm surprised and I'm like so humbled to know that Yen Cat is still a big soul, you know, cultural significance. Like it's been almost 10 years and memes nowadays you know a lot of them are like you know they they last a week or so and then people move on to the next thing but nyan cat's always kind of resonated with people and it's always been something that people remember and it's crazy knowing that my art is like a household name across the world the recent announcement from Christie's Auction House uh, planning to sell its first ever NFT layer this month with is a huge deal. What do you think this means for meme creators and digital artists going forward? I think that makes things serious. Like a lot of people, <clears throat> let me <laughs> let me rewind back a little bit. So like there was an article that came out for the New York Times about NFTs and I was reading the comments and everybody in the comments was like, what is going on? Why is everybody doing this? This is just a picture. You can just download it, <clears throat> but they don't get it. They don't get that NFTs are a little more different than them. NFTs like are one of a kind. Starting soon, we're gonna see lots of big time museums get into the work, lots of like art being displayed, lots of like really cool collaboration attempts. And I think this is kind of how art is evolving. Um, it's still all over the place. People are still trying to understand it. I'm still trying to understand it. But I think I think that's just, just where things are headed, and I think um, it's going to be a really cool process. I'm just thankful, like for for all of it, for like all of the all of the the support and and all the comments and all the like everybody like finding interest in it. And I'm just I'm 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 like really excited because like it's kind of just been it's been a slow year, so everything's like now just kickstarting, and now I'm like getting really artistic, and I'm like. I, again, I haven't slept and I haven't slept much, <laughs> but, but this is all good. These are all good things. I see it all as a good future for my stuff. And I'm, I'm just like, I'm ready to just, just keep going.